Let's talk dusters. What duster should you use and can you rewash it and reuse it? I'm Angela Brown and this is Ask a House Cleaner. This is a show where you get to ask a house cleaning question and I get to help you find an answer. Now you can go to askahousecleaner.com. Right there in the corner is a blue button. When you click on that, you can send your message to me here at the show. Somebody called in and they asked this question. Hi, Angela. I have been in business a little over a year now, so I do love your videos and your show. Thank you for always answering questions for all of us out there. Um, my question today is about microfiber dusters. I specifically have the kind that you cannot detach and just throw into the wash machine. So I hand wash them and then air dry them. My question is, is there a quicker and easier way to wash these? And how many times do you think you can wash and reuse them before replacing them? Also, when you have ones that are extremely dirty, do you just toss those and replace them? Or the, one, or the houses that um, you're knocking down cobwebs or that's extremely dusty, should you use a disposable duster instead? Uh, what are your recommendations? Thank you so much for answering my question. All right, the question is about microfiber dusters and can we rewash them? The answer is yes, you can. There are microfiber dusters that work really well to be washed, but it's usually those with the replaceable heads. And for that, I've got a couple here with me. This is what I call Big Red. It slides onto an OXO handle, and it's a really great comfort grip handle. And this you can use for dusting walls. It's got a lot of density to the duster itself. So while it picks up the dust, it kind of holds the dust. It gets dusty really quick. But then you take off the, the sleeve, and you throw that inside the washing machine, and you wash it. Okay. So this is a washable, reusable one, and it's a good duster. And I wouldn't use it on every house because it has to be washed between houses, okay? So if you have four houses that you're cleaning, you need four heads because you're not gonna have time between each house then to rewash it. And we don't under any circumstance, any circumstance, wanna use a duster and then not clean it and take it to another home, okay? For this reason, if I go into someone's home and I'm touching every single surface in their home with my duster, that somebody could have like wiped their nose or wiped their eyes or sneezed or coughed or held their hands over their mouth, then touched a light, you know, flipped on a light or a light switch and we go and we dust it. We just picked up their germs on our duster. So if we're then spreading that, touching everything in the house, that's contained in that house. But if we take that same duster to another person's house and we touch everything in their house, we're taking the pet dander and the germs and all the stuff from one house into another house, okay? So we don't ever want to cross-contaminate by taking a duster from one house into another without it first being cleaned. So if you have dusters that are on a stick and you can't wash the sleeves, you're going to have to wash those every single night between jobs and then hope that they're dry the next day when you use them. So you're going to need a lot of those to run a cleaning business. And if you don't have a lot of those, please go with a disposable kind. Okay? We do have sleeves that are washable that fit on different pieces of equipment and they're used for different things. These are primarily in my business used for deep cleaning projects. My go-to duster is gonna be the Swiffer Duster. They do sell reusable sleeves. I don't actually use or recommend them for the reasons that I just mentioned. You have to clean them between every job. This is a trap and lock technology. It's patented by Swiffer Duster and I'll share this with you. There are a lot of knockoff heads that you can find on the market. So there are other companies that manufacture these 360 refill pouches. They don't have the trap and lock technology and they don't work as well. And when you use them, they leave little fibers all over the place. So I'm not trying to be a snob or anything, but I recommend if you're gonna go with the Swiffer Duster, go with Swiffer and Swiffer brand refills. I've tried them all and I'm a really big fan of this because of the disposability. They do have the Terra Recycling Program and it is where you take off the heads and you send them back to the company and I don't know how they recycle them, but they do. So if you want to recycle them, you can, but don't reuse them. People have tried to wash them and then they look matted and they still have elements of the dust in them and whatever, because it does hold a lot of the stuff. I just don't think they come as clean and they're not as effective if you try to rewash the disposable heads. So use one disposable head on a customer's house and then take it off, they just slide right off and throw it away before you leave the house. You sanitize your handle, then you go to the next home, you put on a new sleeve, and you just do that by sliding it into the 
little prongs here go inside the sleeve itself, and now you have that for the next home. So use the new replaceable heads on every single duster at every single home. And one of these will last you for a whole job. Now I get asked the question a lot from homeowners, how often do I have to replace it if it's my own home? And the answer is until you think it's dirty, that's the right answer. In a professional home where we're cleaning, we're going through the entire home. And we're cleaning the entire home with a Swiffer duster head. And when you're in your own home and you clean part of one room, it's not gonna be full or dirty yet. And you might get sidetracked to go answer the phone or the doorbell or something, so you're gonna put it down. When you come back, it's perfectly okay to pick it up and continue dusting. And you may not get the whole room done. And then when you go to the next room, you're welcome to take it to the next room and you might do the next room the next day. You don't have to empty it out every time or throw it away after every use. You might get three or four rooms of your house done until it's dirty, you're like, wow, it's not picking up anything anymore, it's pretty nasty, that's when you replace it. But my suggestion is please work smart, not hard. And when we're talking about smart, not hard, we're talking about cross-contamination. So I don't recommend that you buy dusters that come on handles that cannot be re-cleaned, -re where you just pop off the head and either throw it in the washing machine or you throw it away and you dispose of it at the end of the job for the reason that we're talking about germs and carting them from house to house to house. So if there is a house where you've picked up a lot of dust and debris and pet hair, please don't take that to another customer's house. On any duster, whether it's washable or not, please don't do that. Please make sure that your dusters are brand new and like new when you go to a customer's house. You owe that to them. That's why they're paying you all the money for the professional service is because you're bringing professional equipment with you. And this is what professional cleaners are using they're using brand new, clean Swiffer duster heads on their dusters at every single house. And when they come to do a deep cleaning or something, they're gonna have two Swiffer duster heads on their extendable duster, and this is the six foot extender. So I will leave links in the notes to all of this so that you can, guys can take a look. But this is how we're doing this, is we're trying to keep our customers from getting sick by just transferring the germs from one house to the next, to the next, to the next, and then trying to figure out how we're supposed to clean our, our duster heads. That's how that works. All right, I hope it helps. If it does, give us a thumbs up. If you got questions or comments, those go in the notes below. And until we meet again, leave the world a cleaner place than when you found it.